Hey, this is Brett, and this 2022 Chevy Silverado 2500 Crew Cab Short Box LTZ Midnight Edition is stock number 14249Z. I am here at Summit Automotive in Fond du Lac, Wisconsin, your new and used heavy duty truck headquarters. This 2022 Chevrolet Silverado 2500 has the 6.6 .6 liter Duramax diesel engine. It puts out 445 horsepower. It's paired up with the Allison 10-speed heavy-duty transmission. This truck has been fully safety and inspected by our service shop as a fresh oil and filter change. All the fluids have been checked and topped off, and this truck is 100% ready to go. As always, the price and availability is gonna be in the description and um, title for this truck. If it says sold, it's sold. If it's not, good chance it's still available. I'm gonna go all the way around in this video, inside, underneath, start it up. Take a look under the hood and uh, just give you the most accurate representation that I can of the truck, show you all the options, and just give you a really good idea of the condition on this vehicle. Black clear coat is the color. I shoot all my videos in 4K. If you like the video, consider subscribing to the YouTube channel, click the bell notifications, get updates on the videos I do each and every day, as well as having access to one of the largest catalogs of vehicle and heavy duty truck walkarounds on YouTube, 9,000 videos and counting. This one comes with the all black 20 inch painted alloy wheels. It has Goodyear Wrangler Trail Runner tires. These are LT275 65R20s. I would say they have right around half the tread left on them. Frame and underbodies in pretty nice condition. It does have the Rancho shocks with that Z71 off road suspension package. This is a clean title history, two owner, clean Carfax out of Oklahoma, and it has spent the majority of its life in Florida. Front fender's in excellent condition, no major dents or dings in there. Does have the LED headlamps, LED running lights, and the LED cab lights. I'll turn all those lights on at the end of the video so you can see just how bright they are. You get the painted front and rear bumper with the Midnight Edition, and uh, you can see it's in really nice shape, no major dents or dings on there. It does have the front bumper parking sensors. You also get the gloss black grill with that Midnight Edition. This one does have the 360 camera on it as well. It has a true cowl induction hood. I will show you how that works as well at the end of the video. No dents or dings on that hood and the cab lights up top look really good as well. Passenger side front fender, no major dents or dings on there. And the passenger side front wheel, no major scuffs or scrapes. Really nice condition on that wheel. As you go down this side of this 2022 Chevy Silverado 2500, Crew Cab Short Box LTZ Midnight Edition. Take note of how clean that body is, how reflective and mirror-like that paint is. I take these HD videos, so if you're far away, or even if you're close by and you just cannot make the trip down, but you're still interested in purchasing the vehicle, you can see the truck, hear the truck, and have confidence in the vehicle that you're looking at before you even get here. So when you do get here, there's absolutely no surprises, and you can make a smart and informed buying decision from wherever you're at. Now, if this video helps you make that decision or just make the decision to come take a look at the truck, let your salesman know that you saw the video was helpful and that Brett sent you, and then I can keep doing these videos for our great customers all over the United States each and every day. Back tires have just as much tread as the front tires. You do get the felt wheel well liners. Keeps your frame and underbody looking good. Has all the remaining factory exhaust, so it hasn't been altered in any way. And the underbody, what you'd expect on a truck from Florida and Oklahoma, very little to no corrosion. Lower rockers all look really good. It does come with the very nice painted step bars. Side box steps. I didn't see any major dents or dings on that box side. Coming around to the back, you do get the LED tail lamps, the rear bumper with the steps in it, the backup parking sensors, full towing package, which includes receiver hitch and seven pin wiring. And then it does have two hookups for auxiliary cameras. If you want to hook up some extra cameras on your trailer, the tailgate is in very nice condition. I didn't see any major dents or dings on there. It is a power drop down tailgate. You get a very nice spray and bed liner. It does have a gooseneck hitch, four pin and seven pin wiring in the bed. And you do get LED bed lights. It also comes with a 120 volt, 400 watt max plug-in back here. Bed's in fantastic condition, and the uh, tailgate's in pretty nice shape. The other thing with this tailgate is that it is a power up tailgate, so that's a pretty sweet feature as well. Coming around to the driver's side, just as clean as that passenger side, no major dents or dings on the box. Looks really good. And for full disclosure, this back wheel, just as nice as the rest.
Down the rest of the side, the cabin doors all look really good. Once again, no dents, no dings. Paint's in nice shape and uh, looks really good. Does come with the telescopic tow mirrors. They have blind spot monitoring, LED side lights, heated mirrors, and built-in directional signals. And I'm pretty sure they power telescope out and power fold in, so I'll show you that in just a second. Let's take a quick look at the back seats. Obviously, you get the leather seats back here. No rips or tears on these seats. They're in really nice condition. You do get the latch child safety system for any child car seats you may have, as well as the power sliding rear window with the built-in rear defrost. Those headrests do fold down for better visibility if nobody's back here. And you do get in-seat storage back here as well. These seats do fold up. You get a engine block heater cord as well as your winter front and a nice storage area back here. All weather floor mats and the carpeting is in nice shape. No major rips or tears back here. You do get a USB, USB-C and 12 volt power point back here. And the ins, you get child safety locks and the inside and bottoms of the doors all look really good, which you'd expect on a truck. Once again, from Oklahoma and Florida. Let's take a look at the trailering information sticker as well as the VIN sticker. GM is nice enough to give you that. And there is your VIN sticker, no Canadian trucks here. And what I mean by that, we don't have trucks that were previously owned in Canada. Tire and loading information sticker right there. Inside the LTZ package gives you the black leather bucket seats. No rips, no tears on these seats. They are in fantastic shape. Smells very clean inside this truck. I don't think it's ever been smoked in. Both of these front seats are heated and cooled. You get the all weather floor mats up here. Auto headlamps, push button four wheel drive, tilt telescopic steering wheel, power windows, locks and mirrors. You get the nice wood grain trim on the doors. And these mirrors, like I said, do power fold in. I always like showing both sides so that you know that both sides are working properly. And then they do power telescope out. And in. Out. And in. You also get memory driver seat. Pop inside, check out the miles, the radio, and everything that this truck has to offer on the interior. You can see this one has 29,317 miles on it. Instrument cluster is very nice and clean. You do get the heated leather wrapped steering wheel, Bluetooth and information center controls on the right, cruise controls and heated steering wheel controls on the left. You do get the audio controls on the back of the steering wheel. There's your shifter for that Allison 10 speed automatic heavy duty transmission. This one has the Chevy infotainment system on it. And uh, let's get this opened up here. You get AM, FM, and Sirius XM radio, as well as Bluetooth capabilities on this radio. Here are all your different apps, including Spotify, uh, your cameras you can check out, which those are working nicely. You get the 360 cam right there, as well as the front view cam. You get this kind of surround view of the back. You get a view of the front tires, so you're not gonna hit any curbs. And then you also have your cargo cam. And then you also have your receiver hitch cam, which is right over the receiver hitch to get hooked up to your boat camper or trailer the first time, every time. And then uh, let's see if it'll load my navigation system. Probably have to be outside for that to get going. Anyways, down here are your more tactile volume and tune and climate controls, including your dual climate controls right there. Push button start, heated and cooled seat buttons, factory exhaust brake, Parking sensors, you can turn those off and on. You can put your tailgate up and down. Your hazard lights, stability control. That's for your plug-in that I showed you in the bed to turn that on. And your downhill assist control. You also have your factory brake controller, USB-C, USB, 12-volt USB, power point, and a 120-volt, 150-watt plug-in. Down here is your wireless cell phone charge pad, your keyless entry with remote start, and power drop-down tailgate. That's in nice shape, and you do get two cup holders there and a nice little cubby. Dual glove boxes and the passenger side floor mat and seat are in excellent condition. Once again, I don't think this truck's ever been smoked in. The headliner is absolutely fantastic. No rips or tears. You get home link buttons for your garage door security systems and lane systems, power slide and rear window button, map lights, and a SOS and OnStar buttons up there. Let's start it up and take a look under the hood. Check out all those LED lights in the front as well.
starts right up no check engine lights or anything like that and uh, we go to there you go you get a digital speedometer on there as well and I'm going to get all the lights on so you can see how bright they are. I would personally like to thank you for checking out the video today. And hopefully from this HD video, you've been able to verify there are those LED side lights, the quality, condition, options, and of course, cleanliness of this truck all the way around, inside and out. All those LED lights are extremely bright, look really good, as the, are the cab lights. Under the hood, we have the 6.6 .6 liter Duramax diesel engine. This is the L5P engine, 445 horsepower engine base, very clean, runs very smooth. Once again, this truck has been fully safety and inspected by our service shop, has a fresh oil and filter change, all the fluids have been checked and topped off. This truck is 100% ready to go. There is the emission sticker, as promised. The air comes in, the air induction there, goes down this tube, right into the air intake. And that's how that works. Shocks are doing a nice job holding that hood up. And this truck is 100% ready to go. I would highly recommend it from a quality and condition standpoint. And to see more pictures of this truck or one of other 550 new and used cars, trucks, SUVs, minivans, Wranglers, half tons, three quarter tons, one tons, you name it, we got to go to the website right there. SummitAuto.com, full pictures and descriptions of every single vehicle, all at SummitAuto.com. And if you'd like to check out more HD videos, you can go to YouTube.com slash SummitAuto. Click the bell notifications, get updates on the videos I do each and every day, as well as having access to one of the largest catalogs of vehicle and heavy duty truck walkarounds on YouTube. 9,000 videos and counting. In fact, in a second, you will see a link to subscribe to my YouTube channel in the upper left. A link to all the Chevy 2500 truck videos I've ever done in the upper right. Link to this vehicle on our website in the lower left, and a link to one of our latest YouTube videos in the lower right. Click those, check us out. We're super excited to help you with this ultra clean 2022 Chevy Silverado 2500 Crew Cab Short Box. LTZ Midnight Edition in black clear coat. Thanks again for checking out the video. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on the YouTube channel. I really appreciate it. Thanks again.